Hello everyone, this is Eric Long, your general manager, just giving you some updates. Today is May 17th, Friday, and we are at the golf club. You can see behind us, they're stu still working on some uh, roof details. You can see the uh, parapet wall uh, is getting formed up, and we're going to have some stucco uh, lined on that side, and it will match the roof color. Um, Johnny just did a, a, dry, a flyover, so you'll see some details of inside the parapet wall, which houses all the HVAC and exhaust. Um, I'll take you inside to showcase some of the other features that are going on right now. We're outside the golf club and you can see on the exterior walls they're going to be removing the existing stucco and uh, basically replacing all the stucco throughout the whole entire exterior portion of the building. So they're starting on that now and it'll take uh, several weeks but it's going to be a great product once it's all completed. Hello everyone, we're inside the Pelican Pub. They're uh, continuing the framing above us, some of the soffit features, and you'll start seeing uh, this room start taking shape. Uh, they have a couple more weeks of framing, but it's uh, really coming together. We'll start having some drywall put up uh, starting probably next week. We are located in the pavilion. Uh, this is the uh, bar space. They're gonna be pouring concrete uh, the next day or two. You can see they've formed uh, where all the uh, drains are and uh, basically the back side of the, the bar, or the front side of the bar will be located here, and the back side will be over here. So, great things to come. We're outside the pro shop. This is the overflow seating for the uh, pavilion restaurant. You can see that the uh, bands have been poured for concrete. This is where pavers will be located, and it's two tier, so on the front tier there, second, and then there'll be a section over here that we'll be able to use for potential uh, music in the future. We're in the pavilion kitchen. Uh, the guys have started all the uh, electrical work, all the rough-ins are in, and all the uh, Cat5 fiber is starting to be pulled in these areas. Um, so they'll start getting inspections on the electrical on this side of the building quite soon. We are located in the Palm Room, which is our mul another multi-purpose room right outside of the pub. You can see they're still continuing the framing in this area, electrical. We will have a TV in this area that we'll be able to use for any uh, multi-purpose use in the future, so it's a great space. We're located in the main kitchen. Uh, on the east side now, they have uh, started all the insulation of the ductwork. So pretty much on 90% of this side of the building, all the insulation is complete for all the ductwork. We're located on the east side of the building. This is where our chiller is. Chiller pad was poured today, and then also our loading dock area uh, was poured. Uh, there'll be fencing that goes around the loading dock area for the kitchen. You will be able to have some access to the back side of the building, and there'll be a nice little walkway as well. You can see over here. just outside the building I just wanted to mention the uh, weather dash roof tile uh, has arrived this is on the main part of the building they'll start uh, working on the roof tile within the next week or so and you'll start seeing uh, the roof start to take a little bit more shape hi everyone I'm Neil Horrell your project manager with Envirostruct uh, we're in here in the administration buildings here uh, getting ready to start the interior renovations we're getting some uh, verifying some layouts and um, checking some doors we've got some modifications happening throughout the main area as it extends out into the offices um, as well new floor finishes um, some nice wall framing and additional new ceilings and some air distribution changes here so pretty basic on the interior exterior we've got a nice new finish it's a stove finish we'll basically be applying um, a perma base to the existing metal building and then a nice finish that will create um, uh, similar uh, stucco finish that you have on the other buildings so uh, again improving the exterior facade uh, of this building aesthetically for you um, looking to uh, start this here in the next couple days as you can already see we started the demolition started into the framing and then the exterior portion the next week uh, approximately about a four to five week time frame here for the interior to get operations back up and running here in the administration building for the uh, fabulous team here at Sound. Town. So thanks again for your support and Eric with some more details for you. Thank you. I'm going to take you into the administrative office. Uh, Neil just showed you some uh, details. I'll just go over some more. 
So they've taken out all the uh, tile and uh, we're starting to from here. Cleared all this space. Uh, my office will be over here on this side. Travis's will be here. And then on the other side, uh, Denise will be uh, located over there. I'll take you on the other side. This area is all cleared out. This is our little uh, break room area. And then we'll go into the uh, new office space over here. This has all been cleared out and this will get uh, all new flooring, uh, paint, and then ceiling. Uh, we'll also have a, a new wall over here, kind of a featured wall and a nice uh, custom desk uh, for Jade. Uh, and then all the staff is getting uh, all new paint, all new uh, chairs and tables and desks. So about six, six weeks from now, we'll start seeing some great progress. Thank you very much.